man, look at this. California raisins. We'll steal baby Jesus's out of, <laughs> out of thrift stores and stuff, so they keep them behind the counter. Oh, look here, this would be funny. Oh yeah, I see. <laughs> I see that one. Before we jump in this video, I just want to let you know there's some items in here you guys are gonna find really funny, and there's some items in here that may trigger you and find offensive. So viewer discretion is advised. Good morning. Good morning. All right, let's see what we got here. What's this? <laughs> Pickled possum peckers? <laughs> Marriage is grand, divorce is a hundred grand. <laughs> it was it was given to me as a joke. Yeah. I had them on the shelf in the house for a long time. <laughs> this might be the most interesting thing I've seen. <laughs> Alright, good luck on your sale. Alright. You have video game stuff? I saw this. So, do you have video game stuff? Yeah, all that's for sale. Right there. No. Most of the magazines are like 50 cents. That's all I got left. So. Gotcha. Do you have any more any video game stuff? Yeah, somebody just come by and bought them. They had one gotcha. with codes in it. This has got cheat codes and stuff. Yeah, probably, yeah. Let me see. I don't know if someone did. It gives you a lot of information, but yeah. That's the last. That's the only one I got left. 50 cents. And uh, the record, what the records ever been picked through, and that's all I got left. Are twenty five cent a piece? Gotcha. Or five for a dollar? <laughs> in the set or collections in this. Make me an off one. Yeah, I haven't come across any gaming stuff in a long time. I've had been out in the yard sales and flea markets. Mm hmm. Is that all the VHS stuff you have? This is all I got right here. What you see out here from this back bar, that's all I got left to sell. Gotcha. Sir, I, like I, I got a question for you. Is the magazines here? Are these all max of them? Huh? Are these all max of the magazines? Yeah, every one of them. And you get the, the finals of... So that's complete set. Are these a complete yeah, set? Yeah. And that complete, one's complete set? With the hot 100s and all that. So uh -huh. finals a piece right now. That, and that's really cheap. But I, I like to let, they're getting older and older. Yeah. What do, you, what do you want if I buy all five? $20. Then. $20? That's a lot of... I mean, they, most of them hadn't even been opened. Most yeah. of them are still in the plaque. My friend, Greg, apparently, unfortunately, Greg's on most of them, but... He, he, he's the one that gave me a, you know, he's got a, he's got a collection of magazines. He's Can got he, every copy of Playboy from the very first print mm -hmm. all the way to the last print. And he's got every single one of them. He got it in his office, but, um. Buy that. Do you yeah. have any more magazines? Is that it? Um, I, that, that's really all I got right now. Gotcha. I got okay. some I saved. I got a, I got one or two seasons back there I saved. It. I got put back, but, um. Right now, if I ever had an extra yard sale, stop by, I might dig them out. I got I got Keep an eye out for magazines such as Maxim, Stuff, FHM. These magazines are really popular in the early 2000s. They featured a bunch of celebrities such as Paris Hilton, Carmen Electra, Ronda Rossi, doing bikini and lingerie photo shoots. They were pretty much the modern day Playboy without the nudity. And uh, these do sell really well. We were able to put these in eight separate lots, and we should get between 20 and 25 bucks per lot. And we should make about 150 tuna bucks once we sell all these. At the end of the day, you know, they always say sex sells. Oh man, look at this. California raisins. I don't know if I did or not. Is this coming off here a little bit? Yeah. Is this broken? 
the bent uh, it looks like it might be bent down probably it's probably gone in and out though. yeah there we go Thanks. let's put those how much you have in this i don't know make me an offer make me a fair offer i i've never seen Get this a before list together <laughs> and make me a fair offer how's that okay one listed for $49.99 and free shipping, one listed for $45 free shipping, and then one listed for $15 for parts that didn't work. How about 10 bucks? That's exactly what I was thinking, 10 bucks. Cool. I mean, I don't even care if it doesn't work or not. I'm literally just gonna put it, I'm literally gonna put that on display at my house. <laughs> In my little man cave. Super cool. California raisins. I loved them as a kid, I don't know why. I'm supposed to go out buying things to resell, but yet when I come here, I'm buying things for myself every time. <laughs> so, I bought Work take for that. Us. Figures? Well, I saw you had like one on the table yesterday, I saw. Somebody might have picked it up. And that yeah. might have been who asked about raisins. Oh, that's who it probably was so, then. Yeah. That's listed on eBay for 89. Yeah. Um, I'll go 40 if you're interested on yeah, it. Yeah, you get a piece broken in there. It's in there. Yeah, yeah, so but, yeah. Um, I'll pass. It always does that. Yeah, I know. Oh, it's my. trust me, I've dealt with so many pieces similar to that, and they're always breaking, unfortunately. We have the baby Jesus too. We mm. just have them up here because people like to steal them. Really? Oh, people steal baby Jesuses out of, <laughs> out of thrift stores and stuff, so they keep them behind the counter. I had no idea that. Ba yep. Only baby Jesus they steal. The only the baby Jesus. That defeats the whole purpose of getting baby Jesus. I think this absolutely nuts that people will go into thrift stores and steal the baby Jesus from the TV scenes. So if you guys ever heard about that, let me know in the comments down below. Twenty-five. I'll go down to twenty on it. Yeah. You guys have any more Pyrex this time? We have four cups. These four cups and that. Oh, the pink one. Oh. How much are you asking for the cups and the this? How much are your witches? How much do you want to offer me? Uh, do they work, do you know? They probably haven't even been out of the Dagon box. I know the one in the back hasn't because the stuff is still in the plastic. Mm -hmm. I mean, most of it. Be fair with me. And yeah, I don't know what they go for. Yeah. How much you have on Mario? What do you have on Mario, Elizabeth? Three bucks. Three bucks. Okay. I know you'll be fair if I ask you to be fair. You come to all of our yards. Yeah. Yeah, there's one listed for... Give you an idea. 25, 11. Yeah, I think I'll pass them. But just so you okay. give you a ball, ballpark. I'll get these right here. When I, when I finish the run, I can help you out with pricing or something. You need help with something. There's all the stuff. Yeah. Oh, here, this would be funny. Oh, yeah, I've seen, <laughs> I've seen that one. But, I mean, yeah. all this stuff, and it's like, is it any value <laughs> this, to any of it? Right, to be honest with you, this is more a novelty piece, but prep. Well, that is, yeah, I know, yeah. yeah. How much you asking for that? <laughs> Super <I don't> cool. <laughs> two bucks. Two bucks. <laughs> Give me two bucks for it. Let's see, she's got that, that this. I'll show you all. See, she has, like, stuff uh, do you have change for 20? I, I only have one dollar and then change for or 20. Really? Already? Okay. Oh, 
told you, just gave me 13. Yeah. There you go. Perfect. All right. All right. Thank you, guys. Do you know what this horse is from, by any chance? Uh, it used to come with the the riders and everything, the yeah. saddle. Yeah. Back in the day, I I actually had one of them when I was a kid. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. You don't have the other pieces for it or nah, anything? Nah, that's just the way I got it. Yeah. It's cool though, right? Yeah. You see what the saddle was? The cow yeah, the saddle. Yeah, because it. Could, and yeah. The cowboys had the rifle. Yeah, that's cool. What are you asking yeah. for it? Ah, I'll take 10 bucks for it. 10 bucks? Yeah, that's a good deal. From what, 73 Lone Ranger? You don't find these out in the wild too often, so it was a cool to pick up and take a look at. But this thing had some sun fading to it. It's missing the accessories. For 10 bucks, it's probably about retail for it. So I decided to pass. Tomorrow, but okay. I'm not sure what all he had. Okay. I'll wait for him to come back out and ask him. <laughs> Do you have any other toys at all? Oh. What's up, buddy? Did you have any other toys at all? Yeah, I actually got a whole book. No. Okay. Can I look through that? Yeah. Cool. A lot of Pokemon items sell really well from the cards, the plush, the toys. These are actually from McDonald's from 2011. They're not the most sought after Pokemon item, but they still will sell. We're gonna put these in probably two different lots and we'll probably get about 40 bucks total for the bag. What do you have on your ammo? Uh, which, which, what do you want? The Winchester? Uh, I'll do uh, 20 a box. 20, and then for this one? I'll do 10 a box. 10 a box for those and 20 for I those? Got, I got another box of those in the house. Okay. Good bird shot. And then uh, what are you asking for this right here? I'll do 20 on all the Pokemon shit. All right. Then does there that might include, be some more in there does too. Does that include this? Do you, yeah, yeah. Okay. You know, just throw all that. okay. Do you have any other Pokemon stuff at all? Or is that it? Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. I'm gonna take a brief second here to give you guys a disclaimer in this video. The next item I'm about to talk about is considered to be offensive. Some people may be triggered by it. And I even debated about putting this in the video, but I think it is very important for us, to, for us to have a discussion on this item because these are things that we do come across, especially if you're a picker, especially if you're into old antiques. The item I refer to it falls under what we call black Americana. Now, if you guys are unfamiliar with that term, these are items from the early 1900s that go to the 1950s. They are usually African-American and themed. And some of these items do showcase African Americans in a very negative stereotype. Make sure you guys stay to the end of the video because we're going to talk more about this controversial item and if you're allowed to even sell this on eBay. How much is that? I'll take 25 for 25? Yeah. Do you know what year it's from by any chance? Any idea on the year of it? Yeah, it's pretty old. No, can't see. You buy out of states or? Yeah, we do auctions of states. Okay, as yeah, I say, it's, 
You have a, a yeah, very collected collection of things, so I wasn't yeah, sure. Yeah, we got our fingers in a little bit of everything. Yeah, nice. Let's find what catches your eye. Yeah. How much is this game? I'll take uh, five bucks for it. Much? That's from the 60s. I, I know, yep. You can tell by this, just how it's, yeah, it's the just, style of it. Yeah, some of the, they're real funny. That's like a Yahtzee game. That's, that's an old yeah. one, too. Look at Never been played. Recently, I picked up some board games from the 1960s that sold really well, so I'm on the lookout for them now. When I came across this one, it was the same style as the one that I recently sold. Um, unfortunately, this one wasn't as, as valuable as I was hoping it was going to be. That's a nice, nice uh, domino set, too, boy. Yeah, dominoes are it's a fun game to play. Yeah. What do you ask for the domino set? Uh, I'll take oh, 15 for that. There's another old game. I don't know. What is Mexican train dominoes, though? There's, tra there's actually trains in here. Yeah, it must be like Monopoly. It must be something different, yeah. I'm not familiar with that. What's this? Another probe. One. 1964 probe. Mm -hmm. 1937. That's what the copyrights on it. Wow. That's cool. Yeah. Was, is that like a thicker stock paper? Yeah, it's a, yeah, it's a stock paper. Yeah. Huh. Oh, that is cool. See. I probably should have picked this one up. He probably would have sold it to me for a couple bucks since it was missing the piece. The mat alone sells for 20 plus bucks. Uh, I'll cash out with this. So, are you tw 25? Yeah. Thank you, sir. No, thank you. This item you cannot sell on eBay, or items like this you can't sell on eBay, or other platforms. But it is part of our history. The reason I put this in the video because there's a famous saying that says, those that do not remember the past are bound to repeat it. And my question to you guys is, do you guys agree that these items shouldn't be sold on eBay because of the offensive nature of it? Or do you think these are items that should be allowed to be sold just because of the history behind them and the story that they do tell? Please be very respectful in the comments when you do talk about this because we're not here to offend anyone. But I'm just interested to see what everyone feels like this. This item you just cannot sell on there and, and rightfully so. I appreciate you guys coming along for this ride here. I cannot do this without your guys' support. So thank you so much. Please make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. Hit that notification bell so that you guys get notification every time a new video drops. If you guys like this type of content, Check out this next video. It's about to pop up here on the screen. Until next time, make sure you guys keep picking and punching.